Okay, here we are. We're in the system. It's currently at F2. I've flashed it up to F3 twice now. It keeps on going back to F2. I will try it one more time. Screw with it again. You have to use the mouse to get down to this Q flash. A big bias doesn't recognize the file. So control delete. System. Oh, now it says it's at F3. Like it keeps on going back and forth between F2 and F3G. Something's screwy with the BIOS. Okay, it can't figure out if it wants to go F2 or F3G. So now it's F that. So let's see. Hmm. 32 gigs of RAM. Um. So I'm gonna go down here and tell it to boot off of the MemTest 7. Since this is a program that somebody should know about. Since you guys obviously don't trust what I'm saying. System info. Look. Hmm. 32 gigs of RAM. Detail by SPD. Huh. Every single memory slot is detected via SPD. Okay. There's 7. There's 8. But only 32 gigs is recognized. Still 32. Currently in F3G. It's going to here. LS Mem, 32 gigs. LS Topo, 3G, bank 0, bank 1, bank 2, bank 3, bank 4, bank 5, 6, 7. D message. SDC is the thumb, the 8 the gig thumb drive it's, that it was wanting to do a, a 
file system check on it because the BIOS didn't unmount it properly. Not a big deal. So far, nothing crazy with PCI uh, resets and gigabit network card up and down because I don't have the network card plugged in right now. Probably should plug it in to see how well this one works. <sighs> Again. Okay. Eight. Okay. The message. IP four and IP six is up. So let's just do a uh, reboot. Well, it's back to F2. As you can see, it keeps on jumping back between F2 and F3G. The BIOS has got something wrong with it. Most likely. But since you guys won't provide any information what CPU you guys use to verify, remind you, this is the 1920X 12 core thir uh, 24 threads. If you validated it on a different CPU and it works, but didn't test on this, then probably didn't validate it completely. Just guessing, not sure. But just to show you, this is frustrating. 